Hello guys. So our next destination is the nearest called this place near Metro Manila. So kung mainit sa Metro Manila, pupunta ka ng Baguio para tumawag malamig. Yun yung sa north side. So pagka nasa south ka naman, ang pinupuntahan na naman para magpalamig is Tagaytay. Ngayon, ang pupuntahan naman natin is the east side na meron sa east. So tingnan natin yung tinatawag nila the hidden private resort. Welcome to Tanay Hideaway! Actually, Tonai Hideaway have two villas. I'm in right now here at Villa 2, which is the smaller one. Ano siya, it's good for 15 persons. Yung iba nag, uh, gusto daw nila 20 persons. Uh, Magpifit na sila dito, kasha naman. They have two rooms, one toilet, a television with a video okay here. And of course, a big veranda. Usually, they set up here for the catering. I'll be showing you. What food are we going to present now? Um, may sala sila dito. We have a big sala here at my back. Refrigerator. Okay, and a stove. A grilling area at the back. So everything is complete. Um, maganda siyang puntahan na uh, bakasyon na na for a family. Family of, uh, kunyari, reunion. Or let's say, meron kayong Christmas party. Or usually, mga birthday party. Anyway. You get an hour and a half to two hours going here to Tanay Hideaway. So, coming from Santa Lucia East. Okay, so, now, I'll be showing you the first room, ground level. So, this is the, the bedroom. It has a queen-size bed and a, and a solid bed. Usually, they set up additional uh, mattress here at the other side. And they have an uh, electric fan because every night, malamig dito. It's like Baguio, let's say like Tagaytay. So across the room, meron naman silang dito toilet. Okay, so that's the shower area and the toilet. Isa lang. And uh, yeah, what else? Let's go upstairs. Second room. Okay, so it's a spiral stair with uh, one, two, and three. Queen bed. Medyo mababa lang yung roof niya. Okay. And meron pa sila dito at the sides of a bed. And extra mattresses at the side. So dito, approximately mga sabihin na natin na dito mga kasha siguro mga around 14 to 15. Sa baba, additional 5. So tama-tama. 15 to 20 persons. Not bad for, for a getaway. So for the minimum rate of around 9,000 if you're 10 persons lahat lahat again you can set up your a catering here they have different kinds of food okay what do we have we have rice we have ano to pancit vegetables pinakbet beef uh, beef and beef caldereta tsaka ano to adobo wow so Atong sinabi ko, that will be our lunch for the day. Actually, they have a different um, set of meals. If you want a full board meal, the rate is only 1,250 to 1,500. It depends. Overflowing coffee, they have water, they have juice. For the whole, whole stay na yun, ha? So, sa, simula tanghalian hanggang kinabukasan. So, may, may magkikater na sa inyo. Meron na kayong um, mag-waiter sa inyo. So, kompleto na. Wala lang po problemahin pa. Or, pwede kayo magbaon kung gusto nyo. Magbabaon kayo ng food, magluluto kayo, mag-grill kayo. And we have a friendly monkey at the back. Ingat lang. Pakamaga. Okay. So, I'll show you the other villa. Pagpunta tayo sa amin. Just across the villa, coming from Villa 2, we will be going to the left side. Ito yung walkway niya. Pagpunta sa mas malaking villa. Yeah! Wow! Well, this villa one can hold up to 35 packs. 
um, they have four bedrooms. Actually, it's three bedrooms and one attic room. Siyang two toilets. And uh, they have a small fridge. Okay, tignan natin yung. This is a small fridge. You can cook here outside. It's a stove that is already for free. Okay. You have your own sala. Television. Again, the karaoke. Three. Nine. So, kahit nagkakaroke yung kabila, nagkakaroke ka rin dito. Walang problema yun. Okay? Hindi nagkakinga yan kasi it's a open, it's a open area. So, this one is the first bedroom. Okay? This is good for two to three persons. You can set up another mattress here at the, at the floor. Tapos, meron din sila here. The second room at the ground floor. Two persons, probably another set up here at the floor. Okay, and they have a toilet. Ta-da! Toilet with a bathtub. By the way, walang hot and cold shower dito sa Tanay Hideaway. Ano lang talaga dito? Um, direct water coming from the the Gripo shower. So, magpapainit na kayo ng water in case ng gusto nyo. But soon, sabi nila, magkakaroon daw sila ng hot and cold shower. So, okay, naman tayo sa second floor. Okay, here at the second floor, you have a space where you could stay. Maybe grab a beer, relax at night. Ngayon dito with a good view in front of the swimming pool. Wow! Yun yung maganda sa pag nandito ka sa ano eh. Sa Bilawan. Tapat na tapat mo na yung pool, di ba? Abot na abot mo na. Pagpasok mo naman dito, meron another set of sala. This area can be converted as a room. So, pwede tayo maglagay dito ng bed. Set up tayo dito ng sofa bed. Then, the biggest room that they have is a second floor room. Just good for two. A sofa bed. And you can place another mattress at the side. And of course, the toilet. May bata pa rin. Diba? Kompleto. Um, cleaning area. Then let's go to the last room. Spiral the tile. So here at the last room, or they call it the attic room, you can find three mattress bed. The same like the second uh, villa. One, two, three. Big floor here. Pwede pa rin maglagay ng mattress dyan. And of course, like what I've said, electric fan lang. So, wala silang ano dito. Wala silang... Actually, pinagpapawisan na ako. Medyo mainit ngayon. Tagulan na, pero dito maganda pa rin yung weather. Pero pagdating daw sa gabi, sobrang lamig daw talaga dito. So, ang laki ng space actually. Ang laki ng grounds. Pwede kayo mag magdala ng tent. Pwede kayo magstay sa tent. Pwede kayo mag bonfire. Pwede kayo mag fishing. Pwede kayo mag team building. Ano pa ba bang kailangan nyo? Um, pwede kayo mag print up. Pwede kayo mag-birthday party. Actually, meron silang pangatlong room. Yung pangatlang room, ang gagawin daw nila is air condition na. Ay! Ah! Walang tako sa pool. Tignan natin yung pool sign. Okay, now the shooting for Pop Talk is starting. Um, let's see behind the scenes kung ano masasabi nila regarding Tanay Hideaway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 